Hello everybody, thank you so much for listening. I'd just like to share with you today a new book I've done, Garrett, called Doorways into Hope and Joy. I'm really happy about this book and the idea is pretty simple. It's something special for Advent and Christmas, which can be times of all the wrong expectations. You know, the expectations that come with work parties, what to get for colleagues, for school teachers perhaps, who to remember, who to reach out to, coping with the traffic. It's a familiar story. And maybe this year worse than ever because we've spent time at home and people want to get out. And this creates a bit of pressure. So this is a book to try and diminish the pressure. It's a little bit of a book to, for a breather, for us all. We all need that. And there's two parts to it, and both of which have a simple idea. The first part, which is the Advent part, is based on the traditional Advent calendar. You know those ones you get where there's a door for each day and behind each door there's might be a chocolate or something else. And the second part, which is about Christmas, is based around Christmas cards. But the doors I've chosen for the first part are not the doors you usually see in an Advent calendar, but there are things like the oven door, the laundry door, the shop door, the car door, the front door of our own home. And again, the cards for Christmas are things like the credit card, the library card, the Medicare card, and so on. All these cards and all these doors, which are really part of our lives. So I've tried to make this book real and simple and something to help people just be a little bit more easy and at peace in this hectic time. So I might just share one with you, if that's okay. The first one from the first day of Advent, and not surprisingly, I've chosen the front door. And there's a picture of a front door and a prayer, a meditation, something to invite you to spend just a little bit of time. Loving God, we step out into the world this day as we do every day. Sometimes it's easy to leave the comfort of home. Sometimes it isn't. But mostly we rush out on autopilot because we're running late. Beyond this door, there are many things we can't control. Situations we can't predict and events whose pace frustrates us. Give us the peace of heart and strength of purpose that allow us to step out and find our home with you, wherever your grace leads us today. Help us this day to be the answer to somebody else's prayer. Amen. So I hope this book might be for you, beautifully produced, a gift for somebody. I hope that the it brings joy to the world. All the best.